very quick tutorial on how to hold a pike prop. You know, this one's already unhooked in the net. Um, as you see, lovely fish just here. Now, one of the easiest ways to do it to start off with is to turn the fish onto its back, keep a firm hold. And you'll notice the mouth opens up here. And you can see those red gill rakers. Now they're razor sharp, and as you can see, they will cut your fingers should you grab one. You're gonna push your hand up inside until you hold onto this jawbone here, and you wanna take a nice firm grip. Once you're there, support the pike's underbelly with your other hand, and then take whatever pictures it is that you need to take. As you can see, this lady here today, lovely condition. We have already weighed her. She was just over 14 with the net, so I'm guessing she's probably gonna be around about 10. But we'll get her back in now for the release. On the line still. know how to hold them, it's really quite easy. Right, yeah. Keep them upright for a little while until they feel strong enough that they're gonna fly, they're gonna swim off again. Lovely big belly on here, she's been feeding really well obviously. She's almost ready to go. There's no sort of time scale that you keep hold of one really, it's just until they feel sort of strong enough to swim off. Uh, this is first fish for us for the day, so uh, still very early in the morning, there was nice frost this morning. It's my first fish of the season on a dead bait as well, so yeah, it was lovely. A homemade dead bait rig. We feel her body starting to curl up a little bit now, so that suggests she's almost ready to get going. Probably just eyeing up the nearest rest spot. What a lovely release. <laughs> So, still not lunch time yet, and thought I'd have a little chuck about with the lure. Um, so I got this one on a western swim. Um, lovely little jack, a lot smaller than the last, but seems to see. It's got a lovely, great conditioned little fish. Here we go. They all seem to be getting nice bellies on them now, sort of fattening up well. Bit lively still this one. There he is. So we're going to get him back in the water now and uh, watch him swim off. something a bit bigger. Let's have a go at him, something maybe a bit more like the one that we had this morning. Ready to go straight away. And he was rather quick. Third pike of the day. I'm gonna pop him back in the water now. He's not gonna weigh him because he's tiny. Go straight away. 